Well, howdy folks. How's everybody doing today? All right, I got something here. It's not a motorcycle, unfortunately. Uh, I missed out on my chance to, to get one and I was day late a dollar short. But anyway, so I picked up not one, but two of these Teo, Teo, Tao Tao, Toto the dog, I don't know. They're 50cc scooters, one owners, got the titles, um, little scooters. This one has 1,919 miles, and this one has 2,958. That screen's going to be clean. This one was actually sitting outside. This one was parked inside the barn, so they got them at the same time. Uh, like I said, I got tiles on them. This one, uh, I was told the blue one, uh, the carburetor was replaced, but I don't know if the the youngster never hooked up the fuel line. Let's see if we can pop this seat up. I don't even know. I don't know if it's the, what key does what? There we go, that key. And inside here is your little glove box. There's a tool kit. Well, apparently this thing comes out of here somehow or was it on the red one I'm not exactly sure uh, thought it was the blue one but let's check the red one here this one I know the back brake works the front brake is nothing so I'm guessing it's missing a cable it's out of fluid or something but that's all to be determined. Obviously, they need batteries. Neither one of them has a battery. Let's see. This one, yeah. This one needs a couple of bolts. It looks like they had this one apart. So I don't know exactly which one had the carb issue. Maybe ah, it was this one, the red one here. Because here's the fuel line. <clears throat> that must be the vent or overflow. And here's the carb. Uh, there is no replacement carb, so I don't know. There's a couple parts here. I don't know exactly what that goes to. I don't know if that's a choke for this. <clears throat> I thought they were uh, two strokes, but they're not. They're four strokes. So I don't know, Dale. I may have to send you one of these beasts since I got not one, but two. Uh, the blue one here. Oh, here. Let's open the little. We got we got fancy luggage racks here, so. Yeah, I'm pretty pretty stoked about that, you know, when we take these cross-country trips. Well, it looks like there's a few screws in here. That may be the screws that are missing for that. And, I mean, this one's not too bad, considering it's been sitting outside. You know, uh, nah, just cases. So, well, what do you expect? Uh... Honestly, I don't have a, this one, the, the both front and rear work. I checked them when I was rolling them off the uh, back of the truck. Uh, this one's going to need a little bit of work on these lights from sitting out in the sun. It's got a little more sun fade to it, but, you know, we can buff it up, clean it up. And like I said, I don't know what my plan is for these. Um, maybe I'll just fix them up and flip them. Uh, the tires look in pretty good shape. Uh, just taking a quick gander at them. They look like they got decent tread on them. Um, uh, that one's got a little bit of a leak of some sort down there. That tire looks good. Uh, apparently their kids used them until they were like 16. And got their license and were then too embarrassed to be seen on a scooter. So I think, um, and I've got to do more looking because um, I don't know where the battery goes. Maybe it goes under the floor here. Yeah, it might go down in there. I'll have to check. A lot of times I've seen them down in there. So I'll need to pull that out. Hopefully they got the batteries in here so I know exactly what size to get. Um, I do have the paperwork on them, but none of the documentation. I'll have to take a look at this, these plastics here and see if I can figure out why they're popping out, but um yeah man i mean i guess they go what 35 40 miles an hour 
I mean, they're definitely faster than the little Honda Express for a 50cc. But uh, here in an upcoming video, we'll uh, pick one. Um, the one's got the, well, should we do the one with the least amount of problems or the one that I know has issues? So, and they swear they, they start and they're not locked up. Um, there is a, oh, let's see here. I know there's no battery, but there is a, there is a Kickstarter. Let's see, let's see if this thing kicks over. Okay. So that kicks over. That's good. And this one here. Gotta hold on to something while I'm doing that. Okay, that kicks over. That wire needs to be reattached. So you lose your high dollar, uh, whatever that thing's called, box. Um, if we look back at this one, yeah, those, if you look at those nuts right there, they're in here for that and a few other screws. So, yeah, this is our big exciting new find. And uh, yeah, I got them both pretty cheap. Um, so, I don't think uh, it's going to take much to get these things running. Obviously, they need a good bath, oiling, check tires better once I get it on something and uh, take out the battery figure out what battery it is I might could take the battery out of the uh, um, KP Mini temporarily I need a new battery for that it's sitting in there but um, and then believe it or not Tao Tao Tay Tay what Toto the dog whatever they are actually sells these parts and a bunch of other places still sell parts for these things so getting parts ain't gonna be an issue and it's Chinese, so parts are pretty darn cheap. I'm going to try to buff these out first. Then I'll try to buff that out. This one's crystal clear. So, yeah, you can see it. Crystal clear. I'm guessing it does have electric start. There's a start button. Run, stop, horn, turn signals, headlights. So, yeah, pretty cool. Um... Blue one here has got a little more rust on the exhaust, but you know, we can put that in some uh, rust blast, clean a lot of that up, shoot it with a little clear or whatever. I don't know if clear would work on that, it may melt it off. But yeah, they're just filthy, man. They need a good bath, good cleaning up. We'll go over them, check the oil, figure out where all the stuff is on them, um, and take it from there. So I just wanted to show you guys my, my super, super awesome buy. <laughs> yeah, all right. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're not bad. I guess they're 12 inch tires. I think, I'm not sure. Let's see if you can see the marks on them. Uh, they're 12s or 10s. Let's see, eight, come on, spin around. Ooh. Yeah, they're 10s. Good though, because I've been really ticked off if uh, those tires from the KP Mini that I sold would have fit on here because they were bad brands making new, but they were 12s. So I'm not too upset with that. And those tires are dirt cheap. Anyway, so there you have it, guys. Uh, yeah, no, I know, I know. I'll put this out. I ain't forgot. I just haven't been, had time. I got these other two carbs to check here. So, uh, but you know, when you get any new toy, you gotta you gotta do a will it run video. Yeah, so you know we'll do a will it run video and uh take it from there so thanks for hanging out man and i will see you guys shortly but wait there's more okay i decided to go ahead and check the battery uh this is a outdo mf superior it's a utx 4l dash bs gel battery um i'm guessing these things have acid in them but uh, there's not a drop in there, so you know, we might could try uh, throwing some battery ass in this thing and throw it on the charger and see if it uh, comes back to life. But yeah, thought I'd uh, share that with you guys. Be like one of those infomercials. You know? So anyway, yeah. And then uh, 
Let me switch hands. We'll get this thing so I don't lose the screws. I ain't gonna put them in there tight. Ah, oh, crap, man. I had that cover off. I was gonna measure that battery. Not big, that's for sure. Okay, let's come over to this one here. We'll call this victim number two. Uh, those mats look like those little pegs up there. I don't know. We might get rig up something on that. Of course, there's four. There's four. Sorry. Sorry for the camera stuff. Usually got, got you guys on a tripod. And then I'm walking you around and banging your head on everything. Yeah, well, I'll leave that there. Yeah, I'm using the proper uh, JIS, Japanese screw uh, Phillips, on these bolts here. Nuts, screws. Because you guys know, I always call them wrong things. It's how I roll, man. It's just how I roll. I had to get my brother to ride him since uh, he about killed himself on the Trail 90. Whoa. Whoa. Make sure we don't lose any of our precious screws there. Okay. Uh, what is this one here? That says do not open. Um, well, I know it's going to be the same battery. This is a... God, that reeks down in there. Oh, jeez. It's like fucking mouse piss or... Oh, God. Nasty. Ah, uh, that's a DTX 4LBS as well. So, ugh. I'm gonna leave that there and squirt that son of a bitch out. Oh, sorry. Pardon my, my language there. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna bother measuring that. I gotta squirt that out, that's gross. It's really, it smells like cat piss. Cat spray, mouse pee, I don't know what. Anyway, now I'm done. So, I'll catch you guys on the next video.